Okay? Okay, this section, again, is meant for parent and child. And again, like what I told you, okay, well, like what I told you, you might have seen this a thousand times, yeah? But again, for me, I love shortcuts. Type in shortcuts if you love shortcuts like me. Yeah, type in shortcuts if you love shortcuts like me. I love shortcuts, yeah? If you have an easier way, drop me an email. I want to hear from you, yeah? I, like, I want to hear from you. Oh my God, my voice is, is, is uh, losing, is getting lost, whatever is it. Yeah, but I want to finish off, okay? Okay, yes, Claire, yes, I remember you. I think I met your child before, yeah? Yeah, okay, thanks. Yes, okay. So I want to give you more shortcuts. Okay, some parents say, I don't like shortcuts. Never mind, okay? But I'll show you and then you'll see what you can do with it. Okay? Okay, so now, okay, this one you've seen it before many times and then I'm going, they want to find the diameter of each semicircle. Okay, fine. So it's just um, here to here, okay? I use pink, okay? I use pink. I hope you can see it. Okay, now, okay, if you look at your PSE booklets, yeah, your PSA booklet will not have these orange boxes. They remind me of the Mandarin oranges that we have given out in Chinese New Year. Yeah, okay, so now parents, I, well, okay, wait. In the question, you have just seen 12 cm, 12 cm, yeah, 12 cm, 12 cm, and where's my pen, okay? You only see, or you only see like, um, what should I do? Okay, you only see uh, like that. Just one arrow and child CM, okay? Okay, the reason why many kids are stuck is because there's nothing there. They cannot visualize air, okay? They cannot see the air. So help your child, help your child to see, yeah? Singapore methods are famous because it's visual learning, okay? The modern method is very popular worldwide. So quickly put in one box of mandarin oranges inside here, yeah, and put that chow cm, okay? Some parents are very fast, they give, me, they give me the answer, but this session is not about answer, yeah? It's about using shortcuts and smart strategies to solve this question and any other question that you see, okay? So I'm going to share with you something that I did and I did until uh, 2 a.m. yesterday and I hope you love it, yeah? I really hope that this one can really help you, okay? Okay. Okay, so now I have put one, okay? I have put, let me use my spotlight, yeah? I have put one, two, three, four, five. Five boxes of mandarin oranges, yeah? Mandarin oranges there for you to see, okay? Okay, now, next. First, I want to move up the Mandarin oranges. Move up, yeah? Leave it up, okay? Then, I'm going to move everything the same uh, to one side, yeah? I'm going to move everything the same to one side. So this is what I'll do. I move the semicircles to one side, okay? Then I move another one to one side, okay? Give me a yes if you are still following me. Give me a yes if you are still following me because sometimes I wonder if I'm talking to myself, yeah? And this is done until 2 a.m. in the morning yesterday, yeah? Okay, so now, then I move the Mandarin oranges uh, to one side and say, come down. Ah, see, magic, okay? Whatever I do to the top, do to the bottom as well. Do to the bottom as well. Then I'll move the semicircle to one side and I'll move it to another side, okay? Now, then I will also move the Mandarin oranges to the right side, okay? The right side and shift down, shift down. Okay, now, can you see on the left side is the same, yeah? Type in RI, type in RI if you have heard before, 
this concept called repeated identity. Type in RRI, yeah? Type in RRI. Yes, okay. Very good. Yeah. For parents who are still clueless, your child must know the 12 basic problem sum types. A total of 12, okay? So, okay. So, next. Because they are repeated, I will just don't care, okay? Some children say, I don't care, yeah? I don't care about them. Then it's gone, yeah? So, your long question, yeah? Your long question suddenly becomes only like that. Is it is easy now? Type in easy if you think that this is easy for you. Type in easy if you think that this is suddenly so easy for you. Yeah? Yeah, suddenly like a tough question got shrunk to bite size. Okay? So, your child has learned model since primary one. So, use model. Use model. Okay? So, give a box to your semicircle. Yeah? Then, 12 plus 12 is a number, okay, which I'm sure you all know. For the bottom part is 22 plus 16 plus 22, okay? Then suddenly, it comes like that. Yeah? So parents, what is part whole? Part whole is one part and another part give you one whole piece, which is 60, okay? So, very good, children. You got it. Well done. Wow. Okay, let me erase. Huh? So, suddenly, uh, you're supposed to be very challenging. PSLE question uh, becomes, becomes just like that. Yeah? Just like that. Okay? Can you see that suddenly your long question becomes just like this? And wouldn't you be able to score higher? Type in score, S-C-O-R-E, if suddenly you realize that you can definitely score much higher than what you have aimed for. Yeah? So, dear parents, this is how we condense a tough question into something that is very manageable for your kid. Because in my opinion, as a father to three girls, three daughters, math should not be hard for our kids. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Your child cannot visualize. Never mind. I will... I will um, what you can do is you can actually help your child to use Lego blocks and do the shifting because probably your child needs something to to see and touch. Okay, Claire? Okay, Claire? Yay! Some children say, I want to get A star. Well done. So, children and parents, I need your help. Part A. Diameter is actually 60 minus 24. Okay? Which is 36 cm. That's it. Okay? 36 cm. Alright? So, so, once you f did for part A, remember the cage technique, yeah? Quickly use what you want to find, what you have found, yeah? So this one should quickly go to B. Don't waste time, yeah? Audrey, you're welcome. You're welcome, yeah? There's no need to thank me. Thank yourself for being present here. It's not easy to sit through one hour of math lesson with Coach John, yeah? But most parents can sit through because it's more interesting, yeah? Okay, so... So, what should we do next? Okay, let me see if I have a slide, yeah? Because I need to... Okay, so let me... Okay, so let me sort finish for you because some parents say, can I have all the answer? Okay, they want calculator pi. Okay, fine. That's what you use in the calculator, okay? So find the parameter, all right? Okay, let me just move back by a few slides. Huh? Some parents say, can you use the top? Okay, see? 
all the animation. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, so can you see now? Can you see now is one semicircle, two, three, four, five. Okay, find these five semicircles first. All right, so what you can do is five semicircles is equals to pi times d over two. Okay, and times five of them. Okay. So what you do after sorting out is 90 pi. Okay? Okay, parents, I am going to I am going to share with you a technique that will help your child to reduce stress. Yeah? To reduce stress. Would you like it? Okay? So that's it's okay to leave it like that. Yeah? It's okay to leave it like that. There's no need to change it to there's no need to quickly change it to 3.142, yeah? So after you take this out, then you quickly, okay, let me just squeeze it here. 90 pi plus, okay? You plus everything. You plus this one, okay? You plus, you plus 12, you plus this, plus this, plus this, which is actually... Okay, parents, can you help me? Because I don't have calculator with me. Is it like that? Okay, parents. Okay, good. Yeah, thanks. Thanks a lot. Yeah, this is given. Claire, this is given. Yeah, this, okay, Claire, all these are given. All these are given, okay? 84, so then uh, parents, this is a technique. Uh. Then after you found this, uh, then you convert it to the calculator value. Okay. Okay. This is one way to reduce careless mistake. Yeah. A lot of you could have known that the answer is this one already. But what probably some of you don't know is you may not know how to convert. Um, you may not know how to keep this pi. Then it's neater. Yeah. Neater. N-E-A-T-E-R. Is neater, okay? Is neater, okay? Okay, so I'll just quick, quickly bring you through what you have done, okay? So let me show you an animation, okay? So this is what happens. And parents, if you think that this is a bit too hard for your child, use Lego boxes, use Lego blocks, use anything that your child can touch because probably your child needs another way to learn not just purely pen and um, paper, okay? Okay, so this is what it is. So remove away the repeated identity, then your, your, your whole diagram becomes easier and becomes just like that, and then it passes like this, okay? Can you imagine this? When you see an exam question and all they need all they give you is, is this, is this, and they ask you to find diameter of the same circle. Would you feel happy? And they give you like three marks. Type in happy if you think that you can do it very fast. Okay? Yes, yes, okay. So parents, always get your child to, to um, further condense the tough question into easier ones. A lot of times we heard other people say that, oh, this is so hard. Are you, it's not fair to my kid. Uh, what, what else did they say? Uh, this, is, this shouldn't be said because my child hasn't learned before. Yeah? You can react differently by taking power into your own hand and using this cage technique and compress them into something that's easy, that is easier. Okay? Type in cage if you will use part of this cage technique from now onwards. Type in cage if you use part of it from now onwards, yeah? Okay, awesome, 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 okay, awesome. Okay, so now, 